Hey, good morning everyone. Uh, this is Rashmi, Asian uh, mechanic guy. And today we had this uh, 2000 uh, Honda Odyssey. This, cars, uh, this car had a couple of uh, problems. Uh, number one, uh, it has a, a leaking uh, water pump. It, the radiator fan also is not working. The AC is not working. And just today, uh, I couldn't start it because the battery is dead. So I will be making a, a couple of uh, videos for this car. And by the way, this car is uh, owned by an immigrant and he just asked me a favor. He's from uh, South Sudan. He's a black guy. And he asked me a, a favor because he is really low on a budget. So uh, I'll do this for charity actually. I, um, I'm not getting uh, anything in here. I just want um, to uh, fix this video, uh, fix this car and make a few videos on it. So, so let's start uh, replacing the uh, water pump because the water pump uh, leaked so bad and I checked al already the uh, radiator and it's already empty of uh, coolant so without further delay or without further ado let's get started okay uh, the first thing that we need to do is of course remove all those plastic shield in here and also yeah, shield in here then we will be removing the bolt uh, on the harmonic balancer and we will be using 19 millimeters socket really super tight uh, I'm gonna get the smaller socket one sec so now I will be using this shorter 19 millimeter socket hopefully I could get a, a torque higher torque Holy crap, that's really tight. One sec. Whoa! <laughs> first <laughs> first uh, part, I'm already having a hard time. So I'm gonna uh, spray it with a lubricant, liquid wrench. And then We'll leave that for a few minutes. So I'm having a hard time to remove the uh, bolt uh, from the harmonic balancer. So what I'm gonna do now is do the one on the top first. So I'll be removing the engine mount, uh, I mean engine cover. So I will be using 10 millimeter Pocket. Then of course you have to remove the negative cable of the battery and this would be the perfect um, container or place to put on your uh, bolts then we need to remove also this that was easy
Next step is we will be removing the power string pump. So get a rug, put underneath because we will be uh, taking uh, or removing the power string hose. There we go. Put there for the meantime. And then there is a one bolt here, 12 millimeter, and then also one here. And then this one, this is where you're gonna loosen. So this is where you're gonna adjust or loosen this power steering belt. So again, 12 millimeter socket so loosen it see the belt is loose but you need to loosen a uh, one bolt over here at the back there you go then actually there's e it's not a bolt. The one below is uh, it's a nut. So one sec. Let's remove the belt. And then let's rem uh, we'll be using a, a ratchet. now okay don't drop it and there you go that's the water pump I mean water pump power steering pump and this is the nut 12 mm nut so now, next step is remove this timing belt cover. So we will be removing this dipstick, put it here, and then let's remove this wire right there. That's the power steering belt. Now this is 10, I think. 10 millimeter socket oh yeah so we got one two three four five so okay got one Flexible, do you see it? A flexible socket. Now I got I got already three, then one more here. Let's remove this wire. We're missing one bolt, but that's okay. There you go, I dropped the bolt. Okay, all right. Let's pick up that bolt right there. So, as you can see, we got five bolts all in all. So, one, two, three, 
4, 5. And we will be removing also five bolts uh, for this uh, rear uh, timing belt cover. So again, we'll be using a flexible 10 millimeter socket. loose hmm. okay that's good I think somebody already replaced the timing belt and they didn't put back those bolt yeah see it's loose now let me check here yeah there we go. Oh, it's broken. So I see this. It needs uh, five bolts also. One here, there, over here, this one, and this one. But for this, somebody <laughs> broke it. Anyway. So that's it. So there's also one, I think that's 10 millimeter. Let me check. Yeah, it's a 10 millimeter bolt. Because we will be also removing this engine mount. Now let's go back below and try to remove that harmonic balancer bolt. <laughs> 